Super Beast and I, we come here every week ready to fight. And we look in there tonight, we don't even see a match on the board. Nobody's got something for us. Well, then all of a sudden, J-Mo calls us out, and we made sure that Gaston LaRue stayed in the ring with him and took a butt whipping like they're supposed to. But we're tired of people dodging us. Everybody back there is scared of us. We'll take any two, any time. Right, Super Beast? Cheer us! Boo us! We don't give a damn! We're the best thing going! It's Supreme! If you don't like it, prove me wrong! Dewey Wellington, tonight we met in that ring. We've met many times before as kids, play wrestling. Tonight it was real. Right in our home, where we ran around as kids. We had a hell of a match. And I extended my hand out to you because you were as my brother at one time. And you spat in my face. You disrespected everything we've been through. And for what, this? Dewey, you want this? You want to go to those lengths? Come fight me. Whether it's next week, in a month, in a year, I don't care. Come try and take it from me.
Vivacious Van Mardigan, you finally felt what it's like to get in the ring with the most gorgeous man in all professional wrestling. So I want to extend my offer one more time to you, Vivacious. One more time. Me and you can be the greatest tag team this company's ever seen. You and I can go straight to the top. I expect an answer by the end of the week. Don't let me down. You know what, last time I was here, Morgan Taylor, you gave me a cheap shot. Tonight, you had to cheat to beat me. You know what, I can say I was a little bit heated at you, but I ain't, I'm fired up! I'm coming for you. You wanna be my tag team partner, huh? <laughs> that ain't something you want. And that ain't what you gonna get. But what you gonna get is these boots to your Rudy Poop!
I was put in three matches tonight. I came in here thinking I was just going to have a normal tag team match, but because of the abuse of power from FUD, I was put in two matches I was completely unprepared for. I was put in a match against Rob Royale and Tommy Cash when I was not prepared whatsoever. And then I was put in a match with Roger Malcolm, who I've never stepped in the ring with, who was here the last time when I was still reffing matches. But nonetheless, I still pushed Roger Malcolm to his limits, and me and Dra Draven still came out as the supreme tag team champions, and that's not going to change because I'm by the book, and no one is better than Gaston LaRue.
heroes. Leon Elliott was your hero, and he fell to chaos. Now this man right here is the new face of Supreme. <laughs> Cause that's just all you care for. That's all you want. It's all you cry for. Is a hero. A hero that'll save you in your time of needs so you don't have to do anything about it. Week after week I've told you, you are nothing more than the little tiny ant-sized civilians <laughs> in a city in torment crying for your superhero to come out and finally save you. I'm here to tell you, you have been living in a dream world. And it's time to wake up. <laughs>